Hi, my name is Andreas. I'm part of the Schubert R&D team. Today, I would like to give you some insights into the different aspects that make a Schubert a very comfortable helmet. And as you all know, there are multiple factors influencing the comfort of a helmet. And today, I would like to focus on the most important one, which are the fitting, the ventilation, as well as the aeroacoustic performance of the helmet. But let's start with the fitting. As we all know, the good fit of a helmet is one of the most important characteristics of a comfortable helmet. But how is good fit defined? In our understanding, a good fit ensures on the one hand that the helmet stays in the in a proper position in the case of an accident. So it offers the best protection to the rider. On the other hand, it offers a comfortable feeling for the rider, even for long runs. So in the best case, the rider forgets the helmet. To ensure a perfect fitting, we perform virtual testings early phase of every project. Here, the Schubert engineers apply different digital head shapes going from extreme oval to extreme round to ensure a perfect fit for all of our customers. The applied head shapes are based on statistically proven data, which were provided by one of the most renowned institute for research and innovation in textiles. Besides the virtual fitting, we also conduct intensive wearing tests also in our wind tunnel, which is a full-scale one, and in addition also on the street by highly experienced colleagues. And as a result, the new Schubert helmet family offers a perfect fit to 98% of all of our customers, with normal, round and oval head shape. And in addition to that, we developed the Schubert individual program to offer a solution for, a, let's say, extreme head shape, so extreme oval or extreme round. In the case of an extreme head shape, the customer has the possibility to install a thinner or even a thicker liner to adapt, um, to, to adapt the helmet to its head shape. In addition, we also offer the possibility to personalize the fitting of the cheek pads. Uh, here are two cheek pads available in different sizes. The sport cheek pad for a more aggressive and stable fit and on the other hand a comfort cheek pad for a softer fit. And in addition to that we apply a high frequency welding inner lining process that avoids any seams. So by this pressure is avoided or pressure points are avoided in the helmet. The ventilation is an important feature of a helmet. The Schubert ventilation system consists of three air intakes, which are the chin vent, the visor vent and the top vent, as well as the air channels within the helmet and the air outtakes. The chin air intake secures a proper air exchange for breathing even in extreme weather conditions. It comes with a washable and exchangeable filter. The visor ventilation reduces fogging to the visor. In addition, with the pre-installed Pinlock 120, a clear vision, even in adverse weather conditions, is ensured. During the development, the engineers paid a lot of attention to avoid any draught to the eye. That's why the visor vent comes with a specific diffuser design. Besides providing fresh air and reducing fogging effects, at the visor, another important function of a ventilation system is to help the body to regulate its temperature. In a less humid air condition, sweat can be easily vaporized and booze can provide a cooling effect to the skin. To optimize the airflow within the helmet, you need to well design the air channels as well as the inlet and the outlets. The C5 air channels ensure a continuous flow around the head. Here, the engineers optimize the length of the air channels placed in the EPS as well in the inner liners to maximize the airflow. Based on the experience and know-how of the team, an optimal solution has been achieved to provide on the one hand a maximum airflow and on the other hand to avoid any pressure points. That's why the geometry of the air channels, the design of the air inlet 
and outlets are very important for the ventilation system of a helmet. The top vent has to build up a high dynamic pressure independently on the position of the head and has also to ensure not to affect the aeroacoustics of the helmet. Furthermore, the C5 comes with a top head pad providing a summer and a winter position. In the winter position, the airflow is minimized to prevent a strong cooling effect um, on the skin. In the summer position, the airflow is maximized. The aeroacoustic performance is another important factor influencing the comfort of a helmet. And that's not only true for the comfort, but also for safety reasons. An aeroacoustic optimized helmet helps to maintain the concentration of a rider even on long rides and also prevents damage to your hearing. But where does the noise come from? At a certain speed, the noise of the wind is dominating. So here we talk about turbulent flow at and around the helmet. Turbulent flow arises um, within the road traffic, at the bike, at the windshield and as the helmet as itself. Pressure fluctuations that occur in turbulent flow are interpreted by the ear as sound. But how can this be used to optimize the error acoustics of a helmet? In terms of design, there are several factors influencing the acoustic performance of a helmet. Here, for instance, we are talking about the shell design, so the shape of the helmet shell, the chin part, the inner linings, to name a few. These different influencing factors have to be aligned really carefully to achieve an aeroacoustic optimized helmet. One of the options, for instance, is to optimize the inner linings. Here is the task to find the optimum between tightness and air permeability as well as the right shape and design. That's why we put a lot of effort into the development, for instance, of our neck roll. So you can see there are multiple factors influencing the aeroacoustics performance of a helmet. Therefore, you need to have a deep understanding and know-how on aerodynamics and aeroacoustics. At Schubert, we have a full-scale wind tunnel available to do our research. The aerodynamic and aeroacoustics of the C5 has been developed in our wind tunnel from the early beginning of its development. Our engineers spent more than 200 hours in our full-scale wind tunnel to optimize the helmet. And as a result, the C5 is the best in class, offering 85 dBA at 100 km per hour on a naked bike. Together with the aeroacoustic performance of the helmet, the perfect fit and the ventilation system, the C5 offers an excellent comfort performance. So we hope you enjoy the comfort of the C5 as much as we do. If you have any questions or something to share, please comment the video or write us an email.